Welcome back to another video everyone. Today we're going to be discussing the PlayStation event that took place yesterday on Crash's 25th anniversary because a lot of people, including me, expected there to be some sort of reveal. And it wasn't just because it's his 25th anniversary and there's conveniently a PlayStation event on the same day, it's because they teased it beforehand like they've done with the other games. What they'll do is they'll send out a mysterious package with some vague information about the reveal to YouTubers, gaming websites, anyone in that space. They did this with Spyro, CTR, Crash 4, even the ports of Crash 4. So when they did the same thing with a giant Wumpa Fruit before this PlayStation event, a lot of people just assumed, okay, this is where whatever it is, is going to be revealed. It's not just that. Canadian Guy did a great video going over pretty much every little thing that has been surrounding Wumpa League because we don't really know what is going to get revealed, but we think it's going to be Wumpa League. So all the evidence in his video, plus the packages that got sent out, plus the fact that Crash Bandicoot social media has been talking about Wumpa Fruit a lot recently, everyone thought, okay, Wumpa League, whatever the hell that is it's gonna get revealed at this event but it didn't nothing happened it's a bit confusing why they didn't show off whatever it was at this event because this was the perfect place to show it off it was a playstation event that hundreds of thousands of people were watching and it was on the same day as his 25th anniversary it doesn't get more perfect than that. Now, do I believe that we're going to see a reveal in a couple days, in a couple weeks? I think so. The packages weren't sent out for nothing. They do this every time they're about to announce something. Not just that, but they said a few months ago they had more stuff planned for the 25th anniversary. It's all pointing to something, I just don't know when, because yesterday really was the best time to show off this thing. So to finalise my thoughts about yesterday's event, I still think this thing exists. I'm 99% sure of that. The other 1% is just that it didn't get revealed yesterday. That was truly the best time it could have been revealed. If they do a standalone announcement, it's not going to have as much attention drawn to it. It's still going to be big, but I highly doubt that they're going to stretch this thing all the way to the Game Awards. So that's the only thing I have my doubts about. When I think of that, I think, okay, maybe the celebration, maybe the extra stuff they were talking about a few months ago were the Wumpa Fruit pinatas that they sent to the content creators. And that's cool and everything. I really like how they get involved with the community and send out stuff like this. But it's a bit too similar to the past where they've sent packages out followed by an announcement afterwards. They've established a pattern pretty much and we're just following it. If there's no announcement that follows it, it will seem a bit out of place. But that being said, let me know what your thoughts are down below. Thank you for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. Definitely subscribe if you're new here and I'll see you all in my next video. Also, I just want to say we're acting very spoiled right now. We got Crash 4 last year. Spyro fans ain't had shit. 